Recently, a well-known male WWE superstar revealed that Rhea Ripley had avoided him ever since her spectacular comeback to the company. The talent in question is none other than Dominic Mysterio, who has long been a part of the Judgment Day on Raw and has a tight relationship with the Eradicator. Nearly three months later, at the most recent episode of WWE Raw, Ripley made her highly anticipated comeback right before Dominic Mysterio and Liv Morgan got into a kiss. When the former women's world champion made an unexpected appearance, the crowd went wild and Dominic and Morgan appeared stunned. Later, it was revealed that she would speak to viewers on the next Monday night broadcast. Dominic Mysterio recently talked to ESPN on his equation with his Judgment Day stablemate in the midst of all of this. Although Dirty Dom acknowledged that Rhea Ripley was avoiding him at the moment, he pledged to make amends. It's unclear what lies ahead for Dom Dom and Mammy in the future. WWE analyst Sam Roberts recently made the following prediction when discussing the Judgment Day podcast. If Damian Priest lost his World Heavyweight Championship at SummerSlam 2024, other members of the group might turn against him. Roberts thinks that in such a scenario, Rhea Ripley would choose Priest's side and they would go on a babyface run together. This week's WWE Monday Night Raw is anticipated to launch with great fanfare. Friday Night SmackDown revealed that the eradicator of the Judgment Day would be the first person to wear the red brand. For those who missed it, the Ripper made a comeback on television last week on Monday Night Raw. When her song began to play in the closing seconds of the performance, she was met with thunderous ovation before chasing Liv Morgan away and facing Dominic Mysterio. It had been several months since Ripley had left. The women's world champion had to give up her championship after hurting her shoulder in a battle with Liv Morgan backstage. Up until the most recent episode of The Red Brand, she has not been seen since. The main issue now that fans are aware of Rhea's return and her Monday Night Raw opening slot is, what will Ripley do first? In this piece, we'll examine a few things that the eradicator of the Judgment Day ought to accomplish the moment the Red Brand's upcoming episode airs on Monday. Dominic Mysterio's career in the WWE has been quite the ride. Initially, Dirty Dom was the knave son of Rey Mysterio, but in 2022, when the Judgment Day corrupted Dirty Dom, things drastically changed. More precisely, Rhea Ripley corrupted him, and the two ended up dating on screen. As they both matured, Dominic rose to become one of WWE's most despised performers and Rhea to become one of its most beloved. Fans are even more frustrated by Mysterio's current behavior with Liv Morgan because of this. The first thing Rhea Ripley might do on Monday Night Raw is discuss Dirty Dom's behavior with Liv and then immediately dump him. As compared to someone who might have cheated or was about to cheat, she will be able to concentrate on her profession as a result. With the exception of the bloodline when they became a SmackDown exclusive, the Judgment Day has consistently been the top group on WWE Raw. Although the lineup has changed throughout the years, this one might be the best yet, at least theoretically. Damian Priest, Finn Balor, J.D. McDonough, Dominic Mysterio, Rhea Ripley, and Carlito are among the group's unofficial members. Liv Morgan is another factor, though that is still subject to change. Interestingly though, it appeared as though Damian was the only one under contract with Rhea Ripley while she took a break from WBB television. Many people think he's headed out of the organization, but Rhea's decision to leave the faction on Raw could be him to it. Why should she stay if the family didn't help her? Last year, Triple H made a significant statement. The game reinstated the general manager post for Raw, SmackDown, and NXT after it had been absent for a number of years. With Adam Pearce in charge of WWE Raw, Alva in charge of NXT, and Nick Aldis in charge of WWE SmackDown, Pearce is largely in charge of making decisions regarding the red brand, including those involving championship matches. Consequently, 
Rhea might challenge Adam Pearce during Monday Night Raw's opening segment and demand, if not outright demand, a championship bout with Liv Morgan. Maybe Pearce should schedule it for SummerSlam, or even later that evening.